everyone, my name is Katie Tepsik. I'm a junior here at Virginia Tech, and I'm gonna show you guys a day in my life here as a student in Blacksburg. It's a little bit cloudy, a little bit dreary today, but that's not going to bring our mood down. Um, obviously, we're starting off today in my car, so we are about to head off to campus for my very first class at 9.05. So, let's get on to campus, shall we? My very first class of the day is creative writing poetry for my creative writing minor. That class is at 9.05. It's a little after 8.30 right now. I choose to get here roughly 30-ish minutes before my class starts to give myself some wiggle room on walking and even give myself some time to pick up something, especially in the morning, to eat. Right now, since I am in Perry Street Parking Garage, Pitt Hall, our newest dining hall here on campus, is the closest to me. So how about we go in there, see what we can find, and then head off to class. This is an aerial view of our brand new transit center. This side is orange, the other side of the Perry Street parking garage is maroon, and these buses will get you not only all around Blacksburg, but also Christiansburg and campus as well. This is how quick the walk is from Perry Street parking garage to Hit Hall, home of Perry Place, our brand new dining center. I absolutely love it in here. It's beautiful. The nine new restaurants are fantastic, but I especially love Addison's Provisions, our grab and gobble location. The way that you pay for anything on campus is with this, your Hokie Passport. You just tap it on that little black thing right there and it goes through. Everything is 50% off, which is great. I absolutely recommend having a dining plan. So now that we've got our apple juice from Addison's Provisions, it's time to walk over to Robeson Hall, just a quick walk through Daring Hall, and then it is time for poetry class. Today is actually a huge day because Metallica tickets are going on sale for them to visit Blacksburg in May. So we are going to be doing poetry while also trying to get Metallica tickets, which is very different genres of activities, but this is so important and one of the coolest things that will ever happen during my entire time here at Tech. My class actually was leaving before tickets even went on sale, but I stayed in the classroom and I secured the tickets, so we're good. After a wildly stressful wait in that queue, I was successful. I got both my student tickets, so I'm officially going to Metallica in May, which is awesome. But now we're headed over to Perry Place yet again for a little bit of post-stressful situation meal time. Here at the Perry Place Chick-fil-A, you can actually order on Grubhub. As long as you tap your phone to that sign right there, your order will be completed and you can pick it up. Food secured. I'm going to go have lunch and then I will see you guys back at my next class. Intro to Cinema is hosted in Hancock 100, which I feel like everyone I know has had a class at Hancock, so it's kind of iconic. My professor released class 20 minutes early, which means I have a lot more time to just hang out, relax, get some work done before I have to go to my campus tour at 2.30, which I will absolutely bring you guys along for. I am all dressed and ready to go on my tour, but first, before we head out, I'm gonna let you know a little bit more about what Hokie Ambassadors is. So Hokie Ambassadors are just campus tour guides. We go around, we give a daily tour every day. There are about three per day, depending on what day it is. The only day that there will not be any tours is on Sundays. We have an open house coming up at the end of this week, September 28th and 29th. And we also have one that first weekend of November. So if you have any interest in visiting tech, definitely come during open house. It's a great time. You're gonna be able to actually see inside of our residential halls, which you can't do on a regular campus tour, but it's 100% worth it to come get a tour because we have an amazing set of guides who love tech, love talking about tech, and it's just a great experience for everybody involved. Here I am in front of the Inn at Virginia Tech. This is our on-campus hotel, as you might have guessed by the name. It's absolutely beautiful inside. There's a restaurant. I have had the privilege to stay here before, but this is where we stand right before our tours begin. So I'm waiting for that 2.30 tour, and I will see you guys after the tour concludes. Here's a quick shot of Torgerson Bridge and the pylons where all of our campus tours end off. Isn't it just absolutely gorgeous? Hi everyone, I just finished up my tour. It went great. And now I'm headed back to my car to go to Henderson Hall to the cinema equipment room to pick up some things that I need for my cinema project that I'm going to shoot for tomorrow. And then I'm going to my final activity of the night, which is intramural flag football at nine o'clock at the field house. And I've had a very long day. It's had a lot of things jam packed into it, but it's awesome being a student here at Tech because there are so many options for academic growth and even social growth with your friends. Just a feeling those days make every day so much fun and no day is the same, which I love. 
This right here is the drill field. As you can see, the cadets are having a lot of fun playing football with each other, just enjoying the weather. It's a great day out today. But this is the center point of campus. It separates the academic region from the residential region. And this is the most memorable part of campus for alum because we are always changing, always growing. I just got home from picking up my cinema equipment. So here's the list. As you can see, I was holding on to it for dear life to make sure that I didn't drop any of the expensive things on this list. All I got was a camera, a lens for the camera, and a tripod. So nothing too major, very basic stuff, but it's for my cinema production class, which I absolutely love. I just started my cinema minor this semester. If you have any interest in filmmaking and movies and anything like that, Take at least one cinema class during college because it'll count for a credit and it's just a lot of fun. There's something for everyone and it's so awesome being able to see your hard work put into a film on a screen. It's it's surreal, um, but absolutely take a class like this just to give yourself a taste of what this world is like. That's what college is for, college is for experiencing. Anyway, I'm gonna go inside, I'm gonna relax for a little bit and I will see you guys when it's time to go to flag football tonight. Hi everyone, I'm here at the Rec Sports Fields and I'm about to do my intramural flag football game. I will update at the very end how it goes and then that will be it for today. So the game ended up getting canceled because it is currently raining, there's lightning nearby. However, we did take the win, so we're ending up the day on a high note. I hope you guys had a great time joining me on my day today.